hello and welcome back to a new i want to say vlog but i'm guessing it kind of is um i've noticed the past couple of ones have been very kind of like day in the life week in the lifestyle and we haven't done a lot of fashion so i thought today slash this week going forward we would do a what i wore in a week i used to love watching these still do so i thought it might be quite useful and it's going to make me put a little bit of effort into my outfits because at the minute I really am t-shirts and leggings sit it out. Nothing wrong with that but I feel like I've got all these nice clothes so I should probably put a bit more effort in. So let's jump straight into it. So jewellery wise I'm actually not wearing any rings, any necklaces which is quite unusual for me. I think I have some minimal earrings in but not main earrings or cuffs because the dress I'm wearing is pretty loud. So this is the dress that desperately needs a good steam. Don't mind Evie's toy over there, Mr. Sloth. He's around always. So this is the dress. It's very, let me pop my bag down for a second. It's very oversized, which I love, especially in hot muggy days like today. And your sleeves, like look how, <laughs> volume this is it's crazy i absolutely love the style of this dress it kind of hugs your shoulders quite nice and actually all the volumes in the sleeve which i love because although it's a big dress it doesn't drown you in the same way that a big voluminous shoulder sleeve might because often i can look a bit wide like that and you've also got your like a dropped hem waist quite 20s and then you've got this pleated skirt and although there's color oh my gosh i know color for me it's a very muted kind of terracotta tone which i like and then you've got your wrap here which is super flattering the only thing i would say is this can open quite wide so i've got a little vest underneath to stop any flashing moments but i love dresses like this because it just feels very floaty very flowy and it's still quite a statement but very comfortable Shoes wise, I've actually just been living in sandals. Like so yeah, these are the shoes that I'm wearing today. They're from Warehouse, big chunky kind of sandals. I really love these Velcro adjustable and my feet at the minute are swelling because of this heat. So I actually love having the ability to have adjustable straps everywhere because I just don't want, ooh, very zoomed in. I just don't want anything touching my feet at the minute or my hands. My hands and my feet are swelling. It's as if I've never been in a hot summer before. So yeah, this is my outfit. Oh, but I do have something quite exciting to show you as well. I have a brand new bag. Bing! I don't know if you know the brand. I think it's Saint. It's either Saint Agni or Saint Agnes. I think I could be butchering it completely wrong, but it's this leather, black rattan bag it's so lovely so you've got the leather top here and the leather bottom which is great because it means that it's not going to get damaged and then all of the rattan goodness is here it's very minimal but i absolutely love this i just did a partnership with farfetch and this was the gift that i got with the partnership and i just absolutely love it i could pick whatever i wanted but i've been lusting after this bag for so, don't mind my hay fever tablets. The swelling in the hay fever is so glamorous. Um, but no, I absolutely love her. And she's black and she just goes with everything. Like it's such a perfect staple to have. And I just feel like this is such a easy everyday look. It is a very easy everyday look. That means summer's here. I absolutely love it. But yeah, today's Monday. And this is Monday's outfit i even went and put a little bit of terracotta on my eyes today i wanted to go a little bit further but yeah this is monday's look hello it's early in the morning so the lighting might be terrible i apologize but happy wednesday today is a shoot day so i've got i always put on like my casual outfit first shoot that because i know i'm going to be sitting in it and then i go ahead and do it. let me check i'm not touching the mic no. And then I'll go ahead and put on my other outfits. Let me just remove this clip. It's super lovely. I got it in a way PR package and it's so pretty. It's like mother of pearl uh, hair clip. Love that. 
Um, but today's outfit is a very me outfit. I have on a ribbed tank top with a hair dye stain, don't mind that, um, from Suzanne. Love this tank top. I just, I really like racer back vests. I'm gonna have to look in, I think, into getting more because this one from Suzanne is just amazing. The quality is so good. It's not see-through at all, even though it is white. And then I have this linen Arquette kind of cord. So I've got the linen beige shirt from Arquette as well as the linen beige trousers from Arquette with some warehouse shoes. Um, I also have lots of different necklaces on, but I'm gonna see if I can try and come back today or not. But it's just, so it's one of those days, it's very busy and I feel like that's Jenna just outside. So today's look. Hello and happy, what day is it today? Adam, what day is it today? Thursday. Thursday, okay, here we go. So today's outfit again, it's just realistic. It is a comfortable everyday outfit. I was out for a walk this morning and kind of just threw this on. Saying that, they are good quality pieces. So I've got myself a white linen shirt that does desperately need to be ironed. Um, this is from Super Dry. It's probably one of the best linen shirts I have in terms of fit and the quality. It's very breathable. It's just lovely and it washes really well. So that was from Super Dry and it's like your standard oversized fitted shirt. And then I'm just wearing joggers just now. So I'm wearing my Fourth Sport um, from Fourth and Reckless joggers in the white, which I love. I'm not gonna lie, this is kind of a bit of a fashion crime, isn't it? The Birkenstocks with the socks, but sometimes you just gotta do what you've got to do. So yeah, the outfit is very boring and very simple. I just tend to style my shirts with just like two buttons and I just let the rest chill. Um, but this is just what I'm gonna wear today because tonight we're actually going out. I know, believe it or not, we're actually going out. And I'll change into something different and then I'll show you that as well, just so you're not getting everyday loungewear looks um because then I actually put a bit more of an effort in if I'm going out so yeah this is today's normal basic everyday loungewear look da -da 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 -da. and hopefully later on we'll have something a little bit more respectable okay you might hear some dramatic playing going on in the background but as promised I'm back with my like evening look. This is kind of the suit on. I love mix maxing, mix matching creams. So this is kind of a cream blazer and then I've got really stark white, I'm going to steam these before we go out, uh, kind of silky collot. And I've matched it with an equally kind of silky fluid blazer, which I love. This is from Warehouse, this blazer. So lovely, it looks so expensive. And then the clots, they were just a Zara number. I'm pretty sure they come in in all different sorts of colors every year. It's one of their staples that they just kind of keep bringing out. And then it is kind of a bit of a tied situation. But if I unbutton this, I've also got a ribbed bodysuit. Now, I don't normally go for this type of color, but I really wanted to do a little pop of something. So this is kind of like an ice blue gray style rib knit. Really nice and thick, amazing quality from Forth and Reckless. And I just think, as a full look, it's one of those pieces that shouldn't work all together, but actually does work. And the heels are while are really like comfortable heels from River Island, and they've got like the puffy um, front kind of piece, which I really like as well, super comfortable. But yeah, it's an outfit that I'm kind of just throwing on with not too much thought. I just need to be hungry. We're going out for food, going out for Japanese food. So I want to be really comfortable, but also want to put in a bit of an effort because I never ever get to go out anymore. But this is a, yeah, this is the full fit. Going out, getting some food for tonight. Only thing I feel slightly bad about is, I don't know any other dog owners out Whenever you do go out, you feel guilty. Hmm. It's a really fun plot of emotions that I've got going on there. Um, but yeah, this is the full look. I'm just gonna, I've kind of put quite a bit of hair oil on my hair to make sure that it all stays kind of wavy slick, if that makes sense. But yeah, I'm actually, I really like how this outfit is. It's kind of an outfit that I would like to wear 
to like an event in London before all of this uh, C word stuff happened. Um, there was so much kind of influencer content creator event and it was great to meet people, uh, socialize, get to know the brands better. And I feel like this would be such a good outfit for that because it still looks dressy, still looks chic, but it's also really comfortable. And at the end of the day, like you're wearing a cotton ribbed bodysuit. So lovely. But yeah, this is the look. I hope you have a fabulous Wednesday and I'll see you tomorrow. I'm going into London tomorrow to meet my photographer slash really good friend. She'll probably kill me for calling her my photographer. Um, but she is a photographer. She's incredible and we're going in to take some pics. And I'll actually leave her name up here in case you're interested. She's really talented. Um, so I'm going to be really quick with tomorrow's outfit. It'll just be a hi and bye situation. Definitely doesn't feel like a Friday. We have a super gloomy day here, which is a bit poop. I mean, it is going to be August. What is this about? But to give context into what I'm wearing, it would make sense if I mentioned the weather. I promise I'm not just a moaning British person. All we do is talk about the weather, I know, but it's because it's atrocious. But anyway, I'm moving on. Um, it's kind of rain all day and it's a little bit muggy as well. It's kind of like that in between and I'm kind of I've just done a little bit of filming Might go out a little bit later. So it's like a comfortable slash smart outfit this Friday Um, I was meant to go in London today, uh, but the weather just called off the shoe and my friend isn't feeling her best so that was called off. So this is the this was one of the outfits I was going to shoot to be fair So I'm glad it's got a bit of use the blazer is actually an Angelica Blick Times um, Naked Fashion one and it's one of their premium range and it's like a black linen blazer which I really love because I love wearing black blazers but they've been quite hard to wear in winter. Not winter, they're easy to wear in winter, sorry. In summer. So it's quite nice to have an updated summer version with a kind of summery linen fabric. Also makes it super lightweight and breathable. It's got these great structured shoulder pads. Like, naked fashion. Really slept on them. They're so good. Like, I feel like a lot of their pieces are really good quality pieces. You've just kind of got to search through it. Anyway, I love the shape of it. It's single-breasted. And then I have, obviously, my St. Agni bag. I mean every day, all day, but I am noticing some wear and tear in it already, so I'm a bit like, am I just heavy handed? Probably. Now my outfit, it's actually like a loungewear outfit, it's from Warehouse, it's old stock. It's a ribbed kind of, oh my God, I it's a ribbed uh, oatmeal kind of colour, it's cotton vest like a thick vest and then you've also got the flares with it as well and I've just paired it with my Tevas, Tevas, I don't really know um but yeah that you can see the fabric a little bit more now that's the ribbing throughout and then it's just got it's like elasticated waist so it's super comfortable and then it's just one of these really like flowy flared material trousers so I absolutely love them and then my trusty which are so comfy. So yeah, this is today's Friday outfit. Not super exciting, not gonna lie. But also not totally dull. Not totally dull. The outfit this morning was. So <laughs> at least you're not getting treated to that. But hopefully with the weekend coming around, there'll be a little bit more interesting outfits. But yep, this is Friday's one. Hello, it is Saturday and me and my friend have decided we're actually going to try and do the shoot we had planned today because there's a little bit of dry spell in this awful rainy week um, and we want to do a bit more of an editorial look which is why I've got these like, oh am I going to focus? Ah. I don't know, am I focusing? Is why I've got these like graphic empty space liner wings on because I want to do a bit more of like a men in black editorial look. Um, so you can't know Adam's trying to get in the shot, but I'm purposely placing my camera so you can't be in. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so the look today is all black. I've got my black blazer from Arquette on, 
and I also have my linen shirt from Arquette as well. I'll probably unbutton another button there just so it's super relaxed because um, we're going to like a cornfield kind of vibe and I want the contrast to be like business suit kind of like what and then the like nature all around I think it'll be quite cool and then on the bottom half I've got these like huge silky palazzo pant type trousers They're really really cool and they, these are from Naked Fashion as well. So it's Arquette and Naked Fashion and they're just huge and they drown me. Which to be honest, I want for the shoe. I want it to look very big, oversized, masculine, kind of weird makeup going on and then all of this nature. So I think it'll be really cool. We'll see how the, the shots look and obviously I'm not going to be wearing this all day today. So I will show you my other outfit when I'm changed and hoping you might actually see some of the images from the shoot if we get it shot and, and i like it um so fingers crossed that all looks well but yeah this is saturday morning's uh shoot outfit so a little bit more out there and a bit more dressy for saturday i'm gonna come back and i'm gonna wear something a bit more weekend appropriate so i don't scare my town but uh yes this is saturday's look mm -hmm. 